welcome to part 29, and it's time to face the music. It's time to face the hardest boss in this game. Oh, Jesus Christ, I don't know what I got myself into. Greetings. I am Culix, Dark Knight of Vanda. Gee, that place sounds familiar. Anyway, I've crossed into this dimension to fight for the Dark Mage. <coughs> Service! Anyway, but this world is uninhabitable for me and my kind. I must return to my own world. Before I go, though, I would like to challenge your strongest knight. Will you accept my challenge? You can leave, or you can accept. I'm gonna accept. I am matter. I am anti-matter. I can see your past. I can see your future. I can see time, and I will consume you. Oh crap. I am going to get bodied here, ladies and gentlemen. This guy is labeled the hardest fight in the game for a reason. You see these four crystals? They all have different elemental abilities to them. That means Culix has five turns. Five turns! Oh wait, hold on, give me a second. No, 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 I don't want to energize it. Rock candy, rock candy, there we go. If you have rock candy saved up, by all means, now is a good time to use it. The more damage you do to them, the better. Also, yeah. Thanks to the safety badge, not that many attacks will do peach any damage. I mean, Toads will do damage. But, uh, everyone else? They're gonna get bodied. I'm not gonna lie to you. They're going to get bodied. Because Culix's, uh, crystals are by far, are by far the highest magic in the game. It is ridiculous. Okay, that was stupid. I should have healed. Oh, no, 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 God damn it. Yeah. It begins. It begins. Ah, uh, you know what? Screw it. Let's just at least do some damage to our good friend, the fire crystal. Man, you guys suck. No, 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 no! Well, that sucks. Uh... I hope I'll be okay. Looks like Toadstool's not doing any damage. Or getting any damage done to her, so yeah. Comeback time! I chose this group primarily because... Uh, Toadstool can actually withstand most attacks. Culex's physicals may actually do more than just one damage to her. Even with Shredder. It... Well, Shredder would basically lower your defenses anyway. Oh my god, you guys are dicks. Seriously, you guys are dicks. I haven't even revived Bowser yet. Come on! Ugh. What a pain. It's okay. It's okay. I am not taking that much damage. Yes, I'm only taking one damage from this. They're gonna use up all their magic. That's right. They're gonna use all their magic trying to kill Princess Toadstool. And when they do, I'm gonna rock their faces. I really am. Oh, and there it is. Culex's physical attacks. Uh... Freshen up, Bracer, anything? Okay, fine, get, get Toadstool the Bracer. Ugh, come on. Leave Mario alone, he's just a shrew. Oh, well. Yep, this is gonna be a long, long battle. Primarily, if you are at the level to withstand this kind of abuse, of which I probably am not. Because some people say to come in at level, uh, god damn, that was ruthless. Anyway, I was about to say, some people say to come in at level 24, some people say to come in at level 19. 
it, uh, to be perfectly honest, you should be at level 25, and even then, these guys will still wreck your shit. I mean, come on! Culex is powerful enough to do that! That's okay! I do know one of these bastards are weak to jump, I just don't know which one. Ah, that one, right there at the end. Leave Bowser alone! And Bowser dies again. God damn it. Ah. And Mario dies again! Well, needless to say, they will all be like Kitty from South Park. That's okay, so long as I have react I mean, time hits, sorry. Why I keep calling reaction cans? But so long as I have time hits, I'll be fine. Uh Shredder, screw you. Uh Max Mushroom's gonna be for you. Or Fright Bomb? Yeah, let's get rid of my prop candy, why not? Yeah, take that! Of course you're gonna go after Bowser, why wouldn't you? Now use the Max Mushroom. Too bad I'm gonna waste a turn, unfortunately. Well, I still have enough Carol Carol Cola to last me, so that's good at all. I only have two left. But still. I hopefully can survive this brutal beatdown. I'm more than sure I'm doing this wrong. Jesus Christ! I'm just looking at this horrific beatdown, man! They'll have to lose MP some to me, flower points sometime! And sorry for the fact that my capture. not my capture card, I mean my. um. emulator has a few frame rate issues and I just got hit with Dark Star, didn't I? Oh, I didn't even mention about the music that we're listening to. What we're listening to is Final Fantasy IV's music. Which, basically, is where Culex came from. In short, Culex is Zemus. Plain and simple. Alright. How do I survive this onslaught of beating? I guess I can't, but still. Oh, come on, guys. You can just knock that off. That's really annoying. Ah. Get up, Bowser. I swear, man. It is really, really getting frustrating to kill these guys. Oh, damn it! Oh, well. I'll just heal him the next turn. Oh, come on! That is so bullshit. Yeah. You, you guys suck. You really suck. I just think, if Toadstool wasn't a person wearing, um, the safety badge, she would've been a mushroom too, this would've been all over, and I'd have to start all the way from the beginning. Why? Because they're brutal like that. Alright. Let's get our defenses shredded again. And... Fuck you! Seriously, fuck you! Okay, enough of this nonsense. I've got Fright Bombs and I know how to use them. Uh, no... Okay, Energizer then. Please don't kill Mario! Yay, it's going after somebody else that's not going to be affected by it! God damn it! Yes, that's right! Go after the person with the strongest armor! 
see what that gets you. Oh, now I'm getting a taste of my own medicine, that's for sure. Alright. Uh, should I use Bowser Crush? Oh, I'm gonna use Bowser Crush. Screw this. And the good part is, all these area of attacks that I'm doing is actually hurting them. And that means they're gonna eventually go down easier. Ah, damn it. Well, I think Mario's about to fall in just a few moments. And so is Bowser. Yep. It was only a matter of time. Place to turn with comeback. You're gonna have to run out of MP eventually, fellas. You can't have MP forever. That'd be bullshit. Or worse, Trima. Ah, damn it. Pick me up, why not? Get up, Mario! And I got a freebie! Woohoo! Yes, that's right! Keep attacking the person that is resistant to your attacks! That is so much genius work! Now, see, Culix, if you were smart, you'd have used Dark Star on Toadstool because a lazy shell would avoid that. No, can't avoid that, sorry. But you didn't! And now, you're going to die, eventually. By the way, did I mention this was a 25 minute part? Ah, uh, you guys are dicks. Seriously. Come back to life, Bowser! By the power of Toadstool! And now, we play the waiting game. Yeah, that's basically the waiting game. We, we wait until they finish doing all their stupid stuff. Eh, uh, I'll hold on to that. Ooh, Bracer! Let's put that on... Oh, that actually beats up his defense. That's a good thing. Of course, you're gonna go after Bowser. Why not? Uh, I'm really looking for it not to heal, but unfortunately, I don't have a choice. I'm gonna go after you bastards! And funny thing is, here's the weakness order for everything here. The blue crystal is weak to fire, as I just demonstrated. The red crystal is weak to ice. The yellow crystal is weak to earth, and the green crystal is weak to jump. And Mario is weak to getting his ass kicked. Wow. I think Culix is also weak to jump as well, I'm not sure. But Mario is equipped with the jump shoes. So even if he had the ghost spell, it wouldn't have helped. Actually no, Culix isn't weak to jump, that's right. The only reason he's taking jump damage was the jump shoes. Alright, I'm down to my last Carol Carol Cola. I hope I can outlast these guys. Cause it don't look like I can! Well, they're not doing that much damage as far as for basic magic. But for really high-powered magic, they're shredding Bowser and Mario to bits! You see, here's the funny thing! Culex could've spammed Dark Star, but he didn't! He could've just used Dark Star right on Toad's too. But no! Instead, he just hits Mario and Bowser with it. I'm not sure why. And Mario is... Oh god, I thought Mario was dead again. He will be if I don't heal him. Of course. It never fails. It, it never fails. <sighs> Screw you! Oh, no, 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 no! Damn it. And they're dead again. Well, that just sucks. Please miss. Oh, god damn it. 
Stop it! Stop it! They're dead! They're dead! Oh wait, I'm still the last one standing. Never mind! Come back to life! And presto! Bowser's alive again! And I lose a turn because he was just resurrected. Fuck you, Culex! But yeah, if you can't beat him with pure uh, strategy, you're just gonna have to tough out all of his attacks. Which is what I'm doing! I told you my body wasn't ready for this, man! I told you I was gonna get body. This is like the seventh time I had to heal Bowser and Mario throughout all this. And I could have handled this fight differently. Yeah, I know, I could have got the super suit, but unfortunately, I'm not that good with the super jump to try to. Oh, god damn it, not that move. Of course! You're just gonna kill Bowser. Why wouldn't you? Yeah, yeah, you know, Q-Lux, you could have been smart and used Dark Star, but, but you didn't. You're stupid. Yeah, because last time I checked, the lazy shell does not protect you from Dark Star, if I'm not mistaken. Well, see? He actually did more damage to Peach than more damage! Now, if he kept doing that, then I would have lost this battle by now. But thankfully, Culex's AI is stupid. Alright, Ultra Flame time for the win! Let's see if I can kill a jewel this time! Or a crystal. Ha! I got the green one! That's less turns! Ah, fuck you and your diamond song. Anyone else? Yeah, I forgot about that move too. You're gonna eventually run out of magic. You really will. Will you stop that? Hopefully this will kill the red one. And it does! Sweet! Now for the blue. Pump gas water crystal. You're the reason I keep dying. And you are too. And there goes Bowser yet again. Screw you! I don't know if I could have came well prepared for this, but at least I know one thing. The setup that Toadstool has is basically keeping me alive right now. If it wasn't for the fact that Culex was too stupid to use Dark Star on Toadstool, I would have been dead by now. Uh, let's see, what can I use? Well, let's use these Frank Bombs, why not? Okay. Frank Bob, yes! I almost wasted my Caro Caro Colo on that. Die! Yes! Now he's only really getting down to one turn. Oh shit, forgot to heal him. Oh well. Come back, Mario. Oh, I missed an action command. Damn it! And Mario's dead again. Oh wait, he missed. Sweet. Come on, you guys. Let's take him down. This has actually gone on longer than expected. Yes, they're almost out of me. Oh, I thought they were almost out of MP. My bad. Jumped the gun too soon. Done, but there's still the matter of Culex. Oh, by the way, I almost forgot to mention. The reason why this guy is hard is you can see he's pounding us with magic and he takes five turns. But Culex's combined HP is 12 freaking thousand. For this game, that is a pretty high standard. Meaning you have no excuse to lose to Smithy. Oh my god. 
I outlast him! I outlast him! Yes! That's what I'm talking about! Alright, time to go to town on his ass. First of all, Fright Ball. Let's get that out of my inventory now. Aww. And hallucinate me for this time. Oh my god. Well, that is a good thing it didn't kill Toadstool, because I would be up Shit's Creek without a paddle if it did. And Bowser is almost dead. God damn it. I can only heal one person at a time. This is a South Park stick of truth, you know. By the way, I may think about playing that game for the channel. Ah, uh, you're a dick. And there goes Bowser again. He's almost gone. Oh, the FP is gone. Was that was it Culex or the Earth Crystal? I'm not sure. But somebody's FP is gone. And I hope I can capitalize off of that. And speaking of somebody's FP is gone, I have... Oh, it's Culex! Oh, sweetness! Both of them are out of FP! Let's go to town on her asses! No! Prepare to die. Yes! Waste turns! I don't care! Now it's time for to get my revenge! Suck it! Suck it long and- Aw, oh, damn it. Forgot he had hard hitting with the physical attacks. Well, all that's left is just to beat him down half to death. And an occasional group hug. That's right. You have no FP. You are useless. Except for your physical attacks. Aw, oh, damn it. Of course. But that's why I saved up this last Kero Kero Cola. And now... We dog stomp him! This was basically my whole plan the entire time because I got pretty much body for the last 19 minutes until I started coming back. Jeez! Wait, I thought you were out of MP! I mean, FP, man! What the hell? Oh well. You're almost done. Helix is pretty low on, on HP right now. Oh, hey, uh, there's nothing else left to do. Come on, Q, it's time for you to die. Um... Nothing, nothing, um... I could use a Lucky Jewel in battle to get some experience points in this, but no. No, my luck is horrible. And Q, has lost FP. Come on, we're almost at the end of this. Can we finish him off? Or will he pull out another meteor blast out of his ass? Or a physical attack one of the two? He... Oh, damn it, he's not dead yet. Group hug! That's right! Stand there and do nothing! As I wail on you! Thank you! Finally! And with that, we have the Final Fantasy IV fanfare, and Bowser reaches level 21. Ah, oh, bless the lord, that was the hardest battle in the game. Sorry about that, my cat just came in. Anyway, with that, we are done with Culex. Oh, sweet lord, we are done with that. Anyway... Uh, let's just listen to the intro to Final Fantasy 1, as he tells us that we could have been enemies in a different game. And now we got the Quartz Charm, which actually does protect people from instant death if they wear it. However, it drops their stats tremendously.
Anyway, with that, we no longer have to worry about Culex ever again. That door is gone. And just to show off how the Quartz Charm works, uh, all your stats pretty much goes down because you don't get that much of a boost. However, it protects you from death. That will be definitely needed against Smithy. So I'll put back on the jump shoes for now because I need the attack. Anyway... Or I could just put on... Or just like the Quartz Charm on one of the two. And I bought the Experience Booster. Chances are I'm gonna use that later on. And sorry about that, uh, apparently my, um, cursor just went outside of the, um, things. And I'm gonna be right back. Sorry for the fumbling and stumbling, ladies and gentlemen, that I did. I came back here to Booster's Tower to show off what happened to Valentina after you beat her in Nimbus Land. Remember I said Booster may have... His Just Desserts? Well, his Just Desserts just fell right out of the sky. The thing is, uh, Valentina is actually willing to marry him. He may have said something nice, I don't know, like he likes her boobs or something. But one thing is for sure, Valentina is going to be with Booster for the rest of the game. And speaking of the rest of the game, in the next episode, I start Bowser's Castle. See you guys in part 30.